you some more breaking updates as far as the Rajya Sabha elections are concerned. The dramatic twists and turns in the Rajya Sabha polling for two seats in Haryana ended in the early hours of Saturday with the Election Commission declaring BJP's nominee Krishan Panwar and BJP JJP backed independent candidate Kartike Sharma victorious. Now, Congress's Ajay Makan lost to Sharma and out of six seats in Maharashtra, BJP has won three seats. Shiv Sena, Congress and NCP have won one seat each. We have seen viewers, there were several controversial statements that had come to light from the political leaders when it comes to the Rajya Sabha elections, then be it about the cross-voting or also the loyalty of the MLAs to their own parties when it comes to the Congress or the opposition as well. Apart from that, earlier as well, we had seen in Haryana as well how the resort politics had continued and my colleague Amandeep is joining us on the broadcast with more details. Amandeep, you know from earlier we had been seeing that there is some trouble there in Haryana as well. Now with the latest uh, twists and turns that have come to light, what more are you picking up uh, with respect to Haryana? Two seats that have ended uh, in the early hours of Saturday and the election commission has declared BJP's nominee Krishan Panwar and BJP, JJP backed independent candidate Kartike Sharma. Well, Priyanka, a lot of drama happened yesterday. Soon after the po uh, polling of Rajya Sabha, and when all 89 MLAs have casted their vote except one MLA, and in fact later the complaints and the counter complaints witnessed by both the parties as well as independent candidate BJP and in fact Congress also. BJP, an independent candidate, has filed a complaint that two of the Congress MLAs have actually violated the rules of casting the vote and seeking the cancellation of both the votes. And even on the other side, Congress has also filed a complaint that BJP is trying to put pressure on the Congress as Congress is now getting the majority for Ajay Makhan. But in the V hours on Saturday, the results were out and the results were like that uh, uh, BJP MLA, BJP candidate, I beg to pardon, uh, Krishan Al Pawar and independent candidate Kartike Sharma both have uh, made a cut to win the Rajya Sabha seats. And in fact, BJP candidate Krishan Al Pawar got the majority of the votes. But in the case of independent candidate, one vote was cancelled by election commission. That is leading to the most controversial part. One vote from the side of the Congress was cancelled and in fact uh, both independent and Congress candidates, they both were staying below 30 and 30 was the number that was required to be the Rajya Sabha member. And in fact then the second, uh, uh, second preference option was availed by the election commission in which Karthike Sharma, independent candidate, made a cut. He was getting the lead in the second preference and that is the reason now the final results are BJP candidate Kishan Lal Pawar and independent candidate uh, Kartike Sharma. They both are elected the Rajya Sabha members from Haryana. And in fact, Ajay Markan lost in the second preference uh, uh, formula. Yes, Priyanka. Well, right. Uh, Amandeep, stay on with us because we have seen how the drama has unfolded there in Haryana as well when it comes to the Rajya Sabha elections. Let's listen in to what the Chief Minister also had to say about this and several other political reactions that we're picking up. ऐसे सब विधायकों का जिन्होंने भारतीय जनता पार्टी का कैंडिडेट श्री कृष्ण पवार जी और हमारे इंडिपेंडेंट कैंडिडेट श्री कार्तिक शर्मा जी इन दोनों को चुना है और सफलता दिलाई है ऐसे सभी विधायकों को मैं हृदय से धन्यवाद देता हूं और ये एक प्रकार की हरियाणा की जनता की जीत है लोकतंत्र की जीत है मैं आशा करता हूँ कि दोनों हमारे नए राज्यसभा के सदस्य राज्यसभा में जा के हरियाणा के हितों की पूरी चिंता करेंगे और हरियाणा के बारे में जो भी विषय है केंद्र सरकार के नाते से वहाँ सदन में उठाने की बात करेंगे